Hello again, PB the Internet. <laughs> My name's Just Board, and this is Just Board Gaming. This is. This is Nick. <laughs> I'm Craig. Sorry, we've we've had to do. This is like our third take by now. <laughs> We're using a phone anyway. <clears throat> and I'm bored. So let's talk about let's stuff. talk about stuff. That's not my normal intro, but uh, we're rolling with it. <laughs> okay, <clears throat> so down to brass tacks. So um, I got home just like a half an hour ago from work. And exactly. We and see we... a few. Sorry. No, you're fine. We see a few YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> we go. We go onto YouTube. Okay, and the first thing we see is Boogie Two Nine Eight Eight reacting to React World by the Fine Bros, mm -hmm. and um. You know, we just decided why not click on it, and apparently, it's just the the tip of this huge controversial thing that the Fine Bros have decided to announce. Um, and Bookie was uh, he was kind of more understanding about it, you know? Right. Like, he, you was, know he was he was he was, was playing for he the was, best. Yeah, he, but was, he was saying why it could be bad. Exactly. He was playing the devil's advocate, kind of. He was talking about all the bad things that could come from it, but as well as some of the good. Of good things that could come from this uh, new thing that they're doing. Um, this then, thing that they're doing, by the way, is excuse me. There are they're um, allowing any channel, anybody, you, me, this dude over here, to use the Fine Bros brands. You know, for uh, elders react, kids react, teens react, stuff like that. To um, use themselves, create their own stuff using that brand, and the the uh, Fine Bros will help you create the video, they'll promote the video, um... And just for a small revenue, like 30%, I think they said? Right. They, they would take they 30%? Would, either they would take 30% or, or we would, it, I don't know. Uh, but, I don't think, I don't think we would only take 30%. In any case... We don't know the specifics. We don't know the entire specifics, but... The thing is, is that from what I can hear, it doesn't sound like a bad thing. Now, don't get me wrong. If the Fine Bros were That's anybody if, else. If they, yeah. Like, we've been fans of them, you know? For we, a long time. We watched their cha sh channel, the show, you know, and we're, we're entertained, and they seem like good people, you know? But They haven't of... given us any reason to distrust them. And I think it's unfair to immediately say that they're hypocrites, that they're... Um, you know, just, just all around bad people for, for taking, you know, something that they love doing and making it global. And now, like, we've seen other people, well, one other person, <clears throat> um, Critical, otherwise known as Penguin Zero on YouTube, and he had a more harsh taking to it, but then again, he doesn't, like he said, he said in his own video, he doesn't watch YouTube, and so he doesn't watch them, so he, the, the the fact of the matter is is that it doesn't really s sound as bad as people are trying to make it out to be. Now don't get me wrong, I can see the problems that come from it. That could they, come right from that it. could come. They from haven't it. done anything. They yet. haven't. All done... they did was announce it. Exactly. But the what what people are afraid of is that they're talking about their formats being used, stolen, um, you know, just being used without their permission. You know, uh, a bunch of copyright claims against them and other people. And people are starting to think that they're being hypocritical, uh, hypocritical because they're wondering what exactly is the Fine Bros format? How, how, do you, how, do you, how do you specify what their format is? Because they do the same thing that a lot of other React people do. Okay. They sit in front of a computer and or laptop, they watch a video, and they react to it. Yeah, I mean, it's pretty simple. It's very simple. So they're wondering if if uh, this is like a uh, cash grab or a monopoly on the React thing entirely. Now, while that could be the case, you know, because we all know that we've we've all had issues with copyright infringement at one oh. point or another, even if we haven't done anything to violate it. But I don't believe that the Fine Bros have done anything to make us jump to these hasty conclusions. Now, if they do do something, you know, then I can understand, you know, like, of course, you know, if they, if right. they do end up abusing it, then yeah, I'm going to be on the other people's sides. But, but there's no point in right now talking bad and taking a bad side because they haven't done anything They haven't yet. done anything. It has been a day. It has been a day since this has been announced, and already people are talking about 
the end of YouTube or something like that, or it becoming more like a Hollywood or commercial market. Nothing has happened yet. I implore people and like Boogie, calm down. Boogie was saying like you know how some YouTubers they're already struggling for you know um, they're already struggling to keep up, and mm -hmm. this big community market whatever thing is going to make it even harder. But what I say is, like, it might actually help the smaller YouTubers more than hurt them, because if you're This doing... is a way for your videos to become promoted. This is a way yeah. for your channel to get out there, to be known, because many, many, many people watch the React channel. I'm not saying everybody does. And, yeah, they, this, they may take a small or big, or... I don't think it's going to be big, but they may take a chunk of the ad revenue or whatever, you know? But that ad revenue that you do get is going to be bigger than if you publish it on your own without any help, right? It... Like, sure, I could just take this video that I made and put it on YouTube, but I'm not a very <clears throat> good channel. People aren't guaranteed to see it or watch it, but if I get promoted by the Fine Bros, then that's going to be a lot more views and a lot more ad revenue that I'm going to be getting. And yeah, they're going to take a small chunk, but I'm still going to be getting a lot more than I would have It's a promotion, and it's not a contract. It's not, I mean, you have to sign some things, but that's just so that, that's just so that, you know, they, they don't think you're going to start stealing things. That's I'm, I'm, I'm not, tone. I'm not <laughs> taking that out, okay? Anywho, the point of the matter is, and I will say in closing, is that while I understand the fears that come out of this announcement, I implore you, do not freak out, stay calm, wait to see what happens, and maybe even take advantage of it, you know? I mean, this could be a huge opportunity. This could be the, the, f the future of entertainment, okay? This could be something great. Maybe. But I... Uh, well, I'm saying could. Could, yeah. But it's not something horrible yet, and it's not something great yet. Just take it at surface value, you know? Exactly. Just, Just wait to see what happens. If it's good, then great. If it's bad, then... I don't know. I'm sure something will be done about it. Exactly. So, uh... That's how I feel about it. Okay. Well, I'm Craig. I'm Nick. And, uh, that's how we feel. I feel like, I feel like they're going against the fine bros a little too much. Because. <sighs> Can we start over? <laughs> yes. Please. Hello, good people of the internet. This is Craig from Just Board Gaming, and this... <laughs> I don't think that's right. <laughs> it's not right. It's not right. Here we go. Hello, good people of the internet. My name is Just Board, and this is Just Board Gaming, and I'm bored, so let's talk, talk about, about stuff. stuff. This is Craig. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. I just... <laughs>